apart. I'm gonna take two lime wedges and I'm just gonna give them a little squeeze and drop them directly into my whipper here. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually, I'm gonna squeeze it into there and then put the rest of the lime in the whipper. And what we're doing with this is, yes, we're adding the lime juice to the cold brew, but there's so much flavor in the actual zest and the skin of citrus. And I really wanna capture that for this drink and add that sweetness from that. So I've got my limes and my cold brew in here and I'm gonna screw my cap on. And then I forgot my little strainer here. Add your strainer in. And then we're gonna screw this on. And then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna charge it with one of the whipper cartridges, one of the nitro cartridges, nitrous, nitrous cartridges. And we're gonna shake it and that is going to allow that lime to infuse throughout the cold brew. The second part of the drink is gonna be our coconut cold foam topping. So what I did is I took a can of coconut milk, just regular coconut milk from the store, shake it really well to really infuse that coconut fat, the solids into the liquid. Um, I throw it in the blender for about five seconds so that I get one equal texture out of this. So a can of full fat coconut milk, and we are using all of it, we're not separating it. And to that, I'm also gonna add one ounce of simple syrup, just to slightly sweeten it. And same thing, we're gonna go ahead, and screw our lid on. All right, charge that up. And now we're just gonna give this three shakes, four. And now we're gonna let all of the gas out. And you just go into a cup so if you have any liquid, it's not gonna spray anywhere. So you hear all of our gas is gone. We'll go ahead and use our strainer here that will keep our limes back. And we're just gonna dump it back right into our container here. Yeah, we're gonna let that foam settle down. 